Well, Tucson's first Latina mayor is getting a second term today. Mayor Regina Romero was sworn in for her second term and in her speech, she talked about where the city has been and where it's headed. And news for Tucson's Isabella Fredrickson attended the inauguration ceremony and joins us live with more Isabella. Hi, Monica. I'm here at the Tucson Convention Center where the Oath to Office inauguration ceremony was held. This morning, the Tucson Convention Center ballroom was filled with people to honor and witness the mayor and council inauguration ceremony. Romero is the first Latino woman to ever be elected and then re-elected to the city's top spot. During her speech, the mayor touched on what Tucson accomplished during her last term, such as establishing the 311 non-emergency phone line, as well as what she plans to do next, which includes a $75 million lighthouse affordable housing program and a $33 million loan to address PFAS in our wells. Tucsonans are saying yes. Yes to the direction that this mayor and council is taking Tucsonans in. Yes to investing in ourselves. Yes to the values that Tucsonans hold dear. And yes, I absolutely accept the challenge. Mayor Romero also announced that Governor Katie Hobbs appointed her to her workforce initiatives, something that Romero says will be great for the city of Tucson. Coming up at 5, I spoke to the mayor, and I'll have more on this ceremony. Reporting live from the Tucson Convention Center, Isabella Fredrickson, News for Tucson. All right, Isabella, thank you for that. And if you would like to read the mayor's entire speech, you can do so on our website at kboa.com. We have the entire speech posted there.